Oh, they got annexed. It was so mind muted. And they're all freed from slavery! Yay. Tristan? Yeah? They are gone. Nice. They no longer exist. That glitch empire we forgot about for several months. Was it just one guy going, I am an empire? I am an empire. Where do you live? I don't know. I'm not sure. Somebody but help me. Our emperor just gave you a system. All right. Everyone there is now my slave. <laughs> <laughs> the population, they're just going along with it, pretending to be slaves. All right. All right, boss. It's like, all right, guess we're slaves. Do you think he knows how to, how to have slaves? No, I don't think he does. I don't think he knows what that is. He just assumes that they're enslaved. Mm -hmm. Not then, knowing what it is. And then we show up and it's... And then our, my government shows up and says, Alright, you've annexed. What? <laughs> oh. Here's the paperwork and here's the procedure that we'll be going out throughout the next few months to annex you. It's the... The poor man. <laughs> Oh, by the way, uh, we'll be meeting up in Tiralam. Uh, Tiralam? Yeah, the top fleet, the the uh, top of Bar Barley will be, will be meeting at Tiralam. For the northern assault, I'm guessing? Yes. Okay. I'm currently doing some uh, fleet reorganization in order to merge my two fleets into one fleet. Why? Because it'd be more powerful and easier to use. Construction complete. Oh, my Titan has joined the fleet, and it's a 40.2k fleet. 16 Corvettes, 8 destroyers, 8 cruisers, 4 battleships, and 1 Titan. So which system do you say to go to? Tiralam. Tiralam? Already. It is honest. It's very ironic that he has to go through Barlonian space to get there. That's that's actually how long would it take to get there? It would be seven hundred days. But it wouldn't take as long if I just let the finish let the no, the gateway is nine hundred and forty one days. Okay. Yeah, it, it'll automatically use gateways if it's faster. No, I mean, would it be faster to wait for the gateway to finish? Yeah, probably not. It should increase my unity by a whole bunch. It did! System oh, survey complete. I don't have ten mm. pops. Goes to weasel. Resource replicator. Yeah, I researched that. I think I, I think you can only build it on a uh, mega structures, like ring worlds. Really? I think so. Let me see. Construction complete. Oh. 
Nope. I can build one. Never mind. You can build them anywhere. Huh. What do they what do they do? Plus forty minerals. Nice. Yeah. However, it has an upkeep of 45 energy. Because it turns energy into minerals. I am hemorrhaging energy. Time to go steal it from my sectors. Construction complete. We are spreading our faith to a new world. The ochre? What? I was just thinking about that one squitter says Mediocre. You're a very strange man. Yes. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. 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 Moly! Tristan. Yeah? Go to the H.O. Cry system. Uh, what is it called? Complete. It's called Ho Cry. Gaia. Nice. But look what's on it! Obelisk of Zanam? What's that? I don't know, but look at its bonuses. Immune to orbital bombardment. A mysterious obelisk convert, covered in letters from a dead alien language. It comes with power, and those in its proximity suffer headaches. Interesting. I want... Oh, hey, guess who had a status quo? Who? We got fucking nowhere. The took over. Was there gonna... Was there gonna be any other? No. Figured. <laughs> Construction complete. Okay, one fleet is in position. The other fleet is still on its way. <laughs> so it's gotta go through all the pilot in space. Do you have an assault force from the from the west? Yes. In fact, I should probably move my transport fleet. They're still all the way up in Dravasa, or Davasa.
I figured out the goal for this for this game. What? What? What is it? Have everyone join the Federation. Sounds good to me. Time to reach into the shroud again. Ooh. Is there a... Anyway, we... We're going to do a replay. If there's anyone who can do that. This is all over. Form a covenant with the composer of st Ooh, foo foo. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna pause it and read what happened here. The presence welcomes us with genial familiarity. It speaks not so much in words, but in visions, concepts, ideas. It, it seeps into the minds of our telepaths. So gently and smoothly that one might think it had always been there. A blur of images flash before their eyes. The presence is known as the composer of strands, and it regards our biological forms with curious interest. It shows us a variety of ways in which they can be grown, changed, improved, evolved, if we will only take it into our flesh. It waits for our answer patiently, affectionately. Like a doting father waiting on his favorite child. My option is form a covenant with the composer of strands. It gives him a modifier of plus fifteen percent pop growth speed and plus twenty years to our leader lifespan. Although there will be a price to pay. Hmm. Let's do it. Half it is done. Empire. Half of your empire joins them. All right, I was I was just listening to my phone blow up because uh, the Reddit um, trendings were just updated. <laughs> but the covenant is formed. It is done. We have formed a covenant with the composer of strands. It did not take long for the effects to be felt. A sudden and significant increase in both pregnancy and birth rates that is undoubtedly the work of the composer. However, along with these positive effects, we are also experiencing. A rash of strange new mutations. Offspring born with extra limbs and organs, some of which bear no resemblance to any previously catalogued part of their anatomy. Fortunately, the few deaths resulting from them are more than outweighed by the higher birth rates and the apparent increased vitality of our people. I guess that was the price. Very interesting. You just gain a, uh... The, 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 pops. the only reason I was able to speak to the entity was because of my god... was because of God Empress Wittig. Is God Emperor Wittig an actual god? Empress. Is God Empress Wittig an actual god? I think they're immortal, so yes. Also, they have uh, a skill level of 9 out of 8. So, and they are 207 years old. That's amazing. Plus, plus they have a 
plus, uh, let's see, 40, 50, 56, 65 years to, the, to their life. Well, they have chosen one, which uh, makes them immortal. I know. Unless someone assassinates you. I honestly think that shouldn't be possible. They're the most powerful psionic in the entire empire. They can see through time and fucking space. This is true. I, th I know this probably isn't programmed in, but it should be. Where if, you know that thing where a fallen em where a fallen empire can punish you by uh, assassinating your leader? Mm -hmm. I think that should be able to fail. If if you have the chosen one trait. Wait, it can't the fail. Have granted us new I don't wisdom. think it can. I think it's always guaranteed to happen. The faithful have claimed a new world. Alright, I'm in position. I don't know, I, I still haven't tried my hardest to uh, demand vassalization, though. Cause hmm? I still got some trust I can build with them. But they're not going to join the Federation peaceably. Yeah, they don't like the Space hate... Papacy, Kemplar, or the Orthodox Patriarchates. So, do it! But Migration Treaty. But you'll have a migration treaty if they're your vassal. Do it. Mm. Do it. Don't make me do it. Cause I'll, I'll make claims on them. Uh, well, they have association status with us, though, Cooper, and uh, we can't revoke no, it. Don't. Yeah, they do. Construction complete. We can't revoke it because. Construction complete. Most of the Federation will say no, <laughs> which means I can't declare war. Well, so much for that. Who gave them association status? I don't know. Cooper can't hear us, but it was me who gave it to them. Oh, well, I guess we'll have to do it peacefully. We can still war with the Voxeldar Fire Tribes or the, uh, the Juggle was successor con it. You wanted to put them out of their misery, right? Yeah, I'm all the way over there right now. Ooh. 